Hello everyone, how are you? I um, thought I would jump on here really quick and shoot a very brief um, or at least shorter video than I normally do um, because I wanted to show you guys what I recently purchased and um, cut, like there's three items that I recently purchased that I wanted to show to you and I think I'm going to return two of them um, the first one is these, they're these pants from Spanx. This is a Spanx, and as you guys know, I've like been obsessed with Spanx over pretty much since COVID started. I pretty much live in their, um, their tights because they're awesome. And so I thought I would give like another one of their products a shot. So I bought, this is the Petite, and this is, these are supposed to be like kind of like their slacks. Let me see if I can. These are medium, and these are the classic black straight leg in, in what? Pont? Interesting. So I paid full price which is $138 and these are supposed to resemble um, slacks basically so that's why they have like this faux um, like zipper pocket even though you can't really open it it does have some nice detailing I don't think this angle or this lighting is really presenting the pants in the best light but these are true black I think they look a little not as black in the camera, but they are. And they have these elastic, um, well, why is my camera not zooming in for focusing? That's weird. Let's see. Is it gonna focus? Focus, focus, focus. Maybe it's the lighting. Anyways, so they have these like elastic bands right here. With my camera will focus. You see this elastic band, which is actually very thick and it's very, uh, very sturdy. And I the feel if they don't feel like actual like proper slacks, they do have that you know, noticeable Spanx um, stretchiness to it, but they do feel like this weird hybrid, which I liked, but the only problem is, is that when I wear it, like I get this weird bunching up right here. So I'm going to return these pants because they do nothing for my figure. And in fact, they make me look pretty bad. Unlike their, I really like their uh, leggings which I wear all the time and they look amazing on but these look really bad and see they even have like these faux back pockets and they're they're faux they're fake there's nothing like you know how sometimes the back pockets are just sewn in these aren't these are fake so um these I'm going to return because they I paid what $138 and I really am not happy with them, so they're going back to Spanx. And let me show you the other two items that I bought. The next one I'm going to show you, I'm definitely returning if I can. Because um, I, I actually bought it from this Polish um, company out of Warsaw. So let me get it and I'll be right back. Okay. So the next thing I'm going to show you is this dress from this brand called Nudies, Nudies, I believe. And I found them online um, and they have like these really cute like stretchy dresses which I am all into right now. And so this dress is actually really, really cute. And it also comes with the belt. And I'm trying to find the belt. 
Oh, here it is. Where is it? Oh. It's hiding. Okay. And it also comes with this belt, which is totally cute. And I bought a, because they really only had two choices. They either had a small, extra small, small, which is one size, or medium and large, which was another. So it was like a combination of extra small, small, and then medium and large. Well, I'm not a medium or large in anything. Um, but I'm also not an extra small, so I just figured I would just buy the small. And it fits okay. The only problem is, is that, like, this, it's hard to fit over my boobs. <laughs> like, if any girls out there, you guys know that that can be a struggle sometimes. Especially if, you know, you have boobs, sometimes it's, it's hard. Um, and I also can't, like, see, because it opens up like this. So I can't pull it up because then my hips don't fit. So I actually just got these probably within the last 30 minutes and I tried them on and let me tell you, it was a struggle to get these on. It was so difficult because, <laughs> I mean, I w it took me, I would say a good, maybe I received these, maybe I received this dress like maybe 40 minutes ago because it took me a good 10 minutes to get in and out of this dress <laughs> just because it was so difficult now i think overall the fit is okay but i just don't it it i don't know if it's just a dress but it feels like it gives me this weird bulkiness on my around my shoulders and so i don't know if i'm gonna keep it just because i I don't know if I paid, I don't remember if I paid full price for it or not, but it, um, definitely was, um, a struggle to get on and off. So I don't even know if I'm going to keep this one. I may just have to return it if I can. Um, if not, then I can certainly make it work, but, um, I just don't feel like, and this is a tag one more time for you guys to see. I just, I don't know. And you guys know that I, um, I have a budget and, um, my budget includes money for me to spend on clothes and all kinds of stuff. And, um, that budget is closely <laughs> diminishing because I, I've been spending money. Um, and really it was mostly because of that. Well, really, at this point, I can't blame it on that because I was going to say I spent a good portion of it on my uh, Max Mara coat, but I can't really blame all of it on that. I've just been shopping a lot, so um, I don't know if I'm going to keep it, y'all. I don't know. I'll let you guys know, but it's a beautiful dress. Um, I'm going to see. I don't remember the return policy, so we'll see. And then I have one more thing to show you. Um, and so give me a second and I'll be right back. Okay. So the next thing I just got in the mail was this Alice and Olivia dress. And it's Alice and Olivia classics. This is a six, size six. And let's see, Alice and Olivia by Stacy Bendett, I believe. It is style, let's see, color, black and white, uh, size 6. It retailed for $375, but I got it uh, for a lot less than that. I don't remember how much I paid for it, but it wasn't it wasn't the full price. But I like it because it has this like really cool um, neckline. It looks very 60s. I'll see if I can post a picture of the model wearing it. And I like it because it looks very mod. Now, as you can see, the the belt is attached to it on one side. I like the material. I like 
the way it looks and it also has a lining which is nice um, and it looks cute on the only problem though is that it is slightly too small and I need to lose weight because I literally gained like 10 pounds over the last month or something so I don't know if I'm gonna return this dress I think I'm just gonna keep it because it's not that tight but it is a little bit tighter than I wish it would be so I think I'm gonna keep it and lose weight um, because it's such a cute dress and it's very it's very different I haven't seen a dress like this to be honest with you and ever um, except in like you know pictures of like the 60s and stuff because it is kind of a retro look and I thought it was super cute so see you can just do something like that with it so I really like it um, I think what I'm gonna try to do is probably lose some weight now this material is a bit thick so um, I think this is the type of dress that I would probably want to wear like in the winter, in the fall, when you know like the cooler months um, because I think this was like their winter sale which makes sense right? But look how pretty. Isn't that pretty? At least I think it's really pretty. So and it's one of these pieces that's gonna last a long time. Alice and Olivia is a really good brand, so, and, um, there was actually, I purchased this dress this summer, or last summer, from The Fold, and it, I'm kind of upset, because I actually ended up returning it, it was like a tad bit too tight, and, um, now I wish that I wouldn't have returned it, and that I would have just gotten it altered a little bit, because there was room for some alterations, but for some reason, I returned it, and now I regret it. I now wish I would have kept that dress and just altered it a little bit because it was such a unique dress, and it was such a unique look. And um, yeah, I'm kind of upset about that. So anyway, I think I'm gonna keep this one. I'm, I think I'm, I think I'm gonna return this dress. I'm not sure yet. I think, um, I have to look at the return policy. If if I can't return this dress, I can certainly make it work. Like it's not going to be the end of the world if I can't return the dress. But you know, it'd just be best if if I could. So this, and then I am also going to return this these pants, which I've already asked my husband to print. The return shipping label and this is going to go back tonight so this is going back tonight this don't know yet uh possibly and then i'm keeping this one because i just need to lose a little bit of weight which i intended to do anyway um like i said i regret returning that dress from the fold and i wish i would have kept it and i wish i would have had it altered a little bit which again i could have but i didn't and i regret that so I'm going to keep this one and see if I can return these two. Anyway, that's it for my video. I just wanted to film something really short and kind of show you guys what I'm going to return um, because sometimes I forget <laughs> um, to film those things and you guys know that I like to show you um, like the goodies that I get. And so anyway, I hope you liked this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Let me know. Leave me a comment if you liked, you know, these like little short videos of you know, me popping in here, um, kind of just showing you something small or whatever, something short, um, but let me know in the comments if you like those types of videos, and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. I will talk to you guys later. Bye!